Dreams Production. Aren't you guys like I say in all my videos you want to make sure you brush the hair down first or pick the hair out whatever you got to do to stretch the hair to its maximum potential or lay the hair down. Using my Andy Slimline Pro Li, I'm gonna set in my bald line. Now I'm doing a drop fade, and I'm gonna start right in the middle of the C cup, and I'm gonna drop it all the way down and do the same thing on the other side. After that, I'm using my Andis Cordless BGRCs just to take off the bulk at the bottom.
using my wall cordless seniors with the lever open i'm going up about an inch and making sure i keep it consistent all the way through Now with the one guard open, I'm gonna go up about an inch, but right here you guys notice that I'm going backwards, not up and down. That's because the hair grows straight forward and this is me cutting it against the grain. Not all the time will you have clients that, that hair grows down and you cut it up against the grain. Sometimes you're gonna have to go different ways to get the hair to cut uh, the length you want it. So with the one and a half guard open, I'm just cleaning up that ridge area, just that bulk at the top a little bit. I'm not really gonna set um, a, a thick guideline or anything. This is just kind of cleaning up that area um, at the ridge of my client's head, so. So coming back with the one guard open, I'm just cleaning that area between the one and the one and a half. Dropping the lever on the one guard, I'm just gonna flick out that middle line but keep in mind that this is not gonna take it out. It's just gonna soften it up so you could come behind it with the next guard. So with the half guard on in a flick out motion, flick out that middle line. But keep in mind that I know it says halfway here, like the lever halfway, but ultimately it's just notching it just a little from it being closed. All right, you don't want to. It's kind of hard to judge the middle on these wall uh, seniors, so it's just I just basically just notch it from the close, and uh, I just flick out the middle line from here. So. With the lever closed in a flick out motion, flick out that bottom line. Be mindful of the fact that you're gonna have to open it just a tad when you go into the uh, lever open area. So make sure you adjust as you go up.
Right now I'm using my Andis Prolithium shavers and I'm just gonna bald out the bottom. It's basically making it razor bald so you can add another transition to the blend. Using my wall magic clips, I'm just gonna freehand the top, basically coming off the sides and going straight up. YouTube, this is The Cut, and if you like it, make sure you give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button. If you guys like any clipper that you see, you want to know where you can get it, please check out the links in the description below. Otherwise, follow me on Instagram and Snapchat. My Snapchat is Jeezy360, and my Instagram is 360Jeezy. But it's your boy 360Jeezy, and I'm out of here. Cheers!